Come on over, it's time for Tim Friend. All right, welcome back to Tim Friend. It's me, Tim, your friend and mine. It's the T to the F to the R-I-E-N-D. I can spell. Oh shit, it's Rockhawk. What's he doing out here? Gonzalez. Good time, you pudgy little punk. Uncle Rockhawk's got some advice for you. If you keep stealing the spotlight from me, you're going to enter a world of hurt. Quit making such a splash if you value your puny life. <laughs> what a creep. How dare he threaten us like that? Talk about low class. Wait, he threatened us? You think that hate mail came from old chicken legs? Well, who knows? One thing's for sure, we gotta watch our step from here on out. And that's an interesting point. Uh, we have gotten hate mail, and Rockhawk is one of the three characters that it, it would probably be to send us hate mail. Does does Rockhawk have the fucking star secreted away somewhere? He's using it to, to be so fucking strong? Uh, even while he presents the fake star on his belt, just in case? Maybe he's gotten word that people are coming coming to try to steal it? Maybe from the X-Nauts? Oh, she realized I must be in love with him or something. Oh, beans. You'll be champ soon. Don't tell, but I'm rooting for you. Oh, that's cute. The game is cute sometimes. You know I love that shit. You know I love it. All right. So, gotta go to the ding-dang phone, phonally booth. Let's see what, uh, what old X has got for us this time, huh? Uh, well... Okay, it's just a key. Opens the storage room door in the glitz pit. Uh, local time is now snack time. Ha <laughs> ha the fucking canned sitcom laughter. All right, go to the storage room next to Grubba's office. Yeah, I fucking, I figured that one out. Sheesh, what next? This guy's got us running all over. It's driving me totally nuts. So, I mean, I there's 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 gotta be fucking theories. Like, is it is it Rockhawk? Rockhawk knew we were coming out of our our fucking locker room. Like, was he just waiting for us? Is he headed back to his? Or was he coming to get us and it just happened to be a... A kawinky dink That we ran into him? I don't know. Who does? I mean me. I, I do know. But maybe you don't. And so I want to keep the mystery alive for you. Because it's a fun little mystery. It's a twist that, that... It's twists that I certainly did not see coming. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's Jolene and, the, and a guard. So you're telling me that you have no idea who got inside. What do we pay you for? I'm awful sorry, Miss Jolene. I heard a noise in there, but I couldn't find nothing. Hmm, <laughs> fine. Leave the rest of this matter to me. Go back to your post. And listen to me carefully. Do not ever tell anyone of this, or I'll have your job. Anyway, I'm just gonna stand here while he le- Oh shit, it's you, Mr. Marios. Oh, sorry, Mr. Gonzalez. You! Mr. Gonzalez, this is highly inappropriate. What business do you have here? Please, I must ask you to stay out of places we have no business being. You got it. Like the storage room that I'm about to bust into anyway? I mean, she didn't seem, she doesn't seem to want me in there. And Grubba hasn't fucking said anything about the storage room. Maybe Grubba is X. Maybe. Or maybe is Jolene trying to throw us off her trail? I don't know. Did Jolene hear X coming in here? Oh, it's Miss Mouse. That's right, she is, she does have a role to play in this chapter. Barely. Oh, <laughs> we meet again, you husky mustached hunk, you. You again, Miss Flirtalot. Are you following us or what? You know, security heard you bungling around in here. It was you, right? Oh, please, no one heard me. I'm the best mouse. I'm the best mouse burglar of all time. I'm silent. It's quite obvious that someone else must have been monkeying about in here. Pfft, please. I am like so sure. Hush, all you need to know is that I've taken what I've needed, and now I'll be on my way. As for the rest, help yourself to whatever you'd like. <laughs> and now we must part again, my sweet mustache man. A little kiss. Are you like the biggest floozy ever, or what? Goombella! Don't fucking floozy shame. I almost forgot, my sweet. This arena holds many secrets, you know. You should be very careful lest you end up like those poor souls upstairs. And with that, goodbye, my delectable hunk of cheese. We shall meet again. Oh, shit. The poor souls that are upstairs. What's with that burglar rat? I swear, I'm gonna head bonk her if she doesn't watch it. But whatever. What do you think she meant about some poor souls upstairs? Uh, an exclamation point. It's mail. Find the staircase switch to reach the attic. The staircase switch? What, is there supposed to be a staircase in here? I mean, Miss Mouse did say upstairs, so that would... That would imply it. Uh, is this the party button? It is the party button. Hooray! So this is this is the secret to this room. Uh, they're just hammerable blocks. 
You just you just do a smash. And we get the charge P badge. Something I will probably never use. Get out of here. Maybe we can smash our way through these. And fucking find the switch. It, this, there's, there is a switch here. I promised you. Th I guess we can't hammer vertically, can we? We can only hammer horizontally. There it is. I found it. And now there's a staircase revealed by the flipping of paper. Just like at your old grandpappy's house or some shit. Oh shit, we got a locked door. A shine sprite, which I will gladly take. And we have a conveniently Yoshi jump length to gap. We gotta gotta keep using our party members. Do you remember? Remember how I like that? Remember how I think it's cute? You now we gotta like use Miss Flurry even though it's not Miss Flurry's level. We're gonna be using Lomgom for like fucking the rest of the game. Cause there will be a bunch of these little jumpy little gaps that we can't get across. Also, he moves fast, so once we get into a more open area, it'll be really nice to have him run around so we can move fast. Oh, shit. We in the vents. This is some fucking Paper Gear Solid shit. Oh, shit, it's it's the dot dot dots. Someone's talking down there. Let's listen. That's a thick ceiling. Oh, it was just the scene transition. You didn't find hide nor hair, hair nobody in the storage room, that's what you're saying? Yes, Mr. Grubber. It appeared to be secure. Don't worry about it, sir. I've taken the necessary precautions. It was most likely just a rat or something. Okay. Well, no big no big deal either way. Ain't nothing in there we'd miss too much anyway. Thanks for staying on top of this, Jolene. Hey, and by the way, any word on King K? I'm afraid we still don't know the whereabouts of King K, Mr. Grubber. And so, I deleted a spot on our roster per regulations. The Glitz Pit no longer has any official connection to KP Pete, a.k.a. King K. I have, of course, taken the same steps with all fighters who have gone missing. Who? Fighters sure have been going missing a lot lately. That's the fifth this year. What in tarnation is going on? I haven't heard some security agent saying the pit's cursed. I doubt that, sir, but I certainly don't understand the disappearances. Well, for the time being, tell the other fellows the King K headed on home for a spell. Before it gets out about missing fighters, it sure ain't gonna be good for business, no sirree. Nasty rumors have a way of sending folks running to the hills, know what I mean? I understand completely, Mr. Gruppa. I'll take care of everything, sir. Ooh. Jolene's got a an evil vizier kind of thing going on. You know, Jolene, you're a dang fine manager, but you just plumb disappeared sometimes. I gotta know. Where in the world do you go, darling? Uh, that that's... Mr. Grubba, I know you're my boss, but I don't believe that's any of your business. Easy. Didn't mean to pry now. How about this, then? Heard of the Crystal Star? Uh. No, I've never heard of such a thing, Mr. Grubber. Okie doke. Well, I appreciate your time, Miss Jolene. You can go ahead and run along now, here. Huh. So, uh, she clearly knew about the Crystal Star, but also Grubber did know about the Crystal Star. What does that possibly mean? That means either one of them could be X, because they're the ones who have talked exclusively about the Crystal Star. Well, if this ain't a fine, how do you do? Seems like good fighters are a dying breed. That wild child Gonzalez is just about the only draw I still got around here. Hmm. This, it's, uh, maybe that, maybe I am. Maybe I am being used by Grubba. Maybe Grubba is X. He's using me to try to find the Crystal Star or some shit. Whoa, Gonzalez. Whoa, you hear that? Fighters are going missing, dude. That ain't cool. Is that guy talking about King K, the minor leaguer? I thought he retired. Yeah, me too. What in the hay? Dang, ceiling is spooking me. Hey, somebody up there. So we can squeak, meow, or belch. Of course we're going to belch. Belch. Who knew it? This little burping beetle. Here I am thinking someone's up there a-peeping. I gotta relax. Take some yoga classes or something. Yep. Well, back to the ring. Well, hmm. He does know about the crystal star. And that's... It's uh, a little bit worrying in and of itself that he knows about it. But, he, I mean, he owns the ring. He must have given Rockhawk that belt. Whoa, whoa, man, we dodged a bullet there. Hey, but did you hear that guy blabbing about the Crystal Star? That Jolene lady acted pretty guilty when he let that one slip out. Well, whatever. For now, we better bail before someone finds us up here. I agree. How will we get down? I mean, it's, the, it's fucking obvious. That's how. And now we're back in here. Oh, and also there's a fucking... Boop! A star piece in here. Yay! So. Uh... Upstairs, there was the other direction was a, a locked door that we do not have a key for. Each key is a one-time use type deal. So we gotta go back to the ring. 
We gotta fucking fight it out. We gotta we gotta see what violence will tell us for the of the future. And we're gonna switch to Goombella. Uh, and we can we can also figure out like I think we figure out who the No. Rank one is Oh well, fucking let's let's fucking see. Let's view the rankings. Ham and Bam and Flare, Chomp Country, the Koopinator, and Rockhawk as the champion. So we got four more fights here left in Glitzville. Uh, we got the Ham and Bam and Flare, the Hammer Brother, uh, Boomerang Brother, and Fire Brother. Uh, we got Chomp Country, which is a couple of chain chomps. And we got the Koopinator, which is this incredible Koopa Troll. And then we got Rockhawk himself. And then we should have the Crystal Star, right? Maybe. Well, regardless, next time I'll see you on Tim Friend, uh, we'll find out. Remember to do everything the tax masters demand of us, uh, liking, commenting, subscribing, etc. Keeps you alive, keeps me alive. It's uh, just the world, <clears throat> the world we live in. Excuse me. Had a snack between episodes and it's coming back to haunt me in the form of flatulence. Well, ain't that just, you know, normal shit for Tim Friend. Well, bye everybody. Well, 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 well. Just fucking say well some more. Dumb shit. Hey, don't make fun of yourself. I'm sorry. Wah 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 w